hello my lovely welcome back to my kitchen it is always good to have you here today we are making coco yam and pesie with some fresh avocados infused with turkey berries with tips to make grinding easy also how i chop up my coco yam to make eating enjoyable you would love this healthy dish come along and let's get cooking our fresh produce are here this is our turkey berry square and susa, fresh tomatoes, onions, and mankeni. Coco yam and pesie de winakra. This is our avocado as well. And if you don't have a money or kobe, this is a great alternative. Salt fish. And I also have Ghana taste peanut butter with some eggs here too. And of course, Titus sardines. If we are to compare yams to cocoa yams, yams are much more easier to manage as far as cutting them up is concerned. So I find it useful to divide these into two to start with. It is likely that one side will be bigger than the other. It is okay. Just leave the smaller part as it is and then go ahead and divide the other bit into two yes in this way oh fire what they are what they are it is cut into strips and it is so easy to enjoy your meals this way right it is washed so let's add some water now and then we will add some salt and i've also washed my eggs thoroughly and i'm going to be adding it to the cocoa yam and cover it to cook these are our quintus blood tonic papebi yes it is washed and i'm going to add the onions chilies and our salted fish to boil with I didn't boil the coin to serve with the cocoa yam because once it is cooked, it will go underneath and it will be too difficult to pick them up. Look, our cocoa yam is soft and it is ready to be drained. I will quickly take out the eggs and let them sit in cold water so it is easier to peel. Coming over to our dip, our abomu, I am beginning with grinding some hot pepper together with the boiled onions i prefer to boil my onion just so to reduce the sharpness of it a bit easier to grind in this way as well in goes our turkey berries rich in iron delicious and so very much cherished by many it is so versatile so we hear Diania and Crassi or Mon Pepper Gitabos on Osha Kitchen Wana or blend it from your soups and stews. Before they know it, they are eating something good on our way. <laughs> I have also added the salted fish. Grind it as well. And once that is done, I'm going to be adding some peanut butter. Yes. What is our local abomo without some infusion of peanut butter <laughs> yes it makes all the difference so i've added some and i have grinded it as well now we get to our fresh tomatoes and i'm going to be sharing with you another way to grind your tomatoes easily without any stress if you want to go the traditional way then wash up your tomatoes you can cut it open and take the seeds out chop them into smaller pieces and then add some salt to it to make it easier to grind and go ahead and grind just like so alternatively if you want it even quicker just as how i wanted it when i was making this i proceeded to processing the tomatoes in the food processor after taking all the seeds out and then i added it into my asanka and grinded it afterwards my dear it was so easy no stress at all 
Obe kata we ni ate na a grind ye we. <laughs> yes, look, it is almost coming together. If you have noticed, I have put the earthenware on the cooker on a low heat whilst you do the finishing touches and let it warm up. It also gives it that earthenware flavor if you know what i'm talking about you just know what i mean <laughs> yes i have just chopped some fresh onions and i'm topping it up with our title sardine hello welcome my name is Ousua. if you are new to the channel please do not hesitate to subscribe with your bell activated and to my returning subscribers words cannot express how grateful i am thank you now this is how our ampicia looks like it looks so delicious i'll go in and chop up our avocados just take a look at how delicious healthy and easy this meal is to put together yes this is what i mean by it will be easier to enjoy when it is chopped this way you just take it and dip the ends in your abomo now why will you cry <laughs> i hope you do like this recipe this delicious meal please like this video subscribe share comment and i'll see you in my next video take care bye bye